Back home now and the big Seaford family with even bigger hearts. The Walters, who comprise of mum, dad and ten siblings, are trying to expand their breakfast club, which helps feed hundreds of disadvantaged children in the southern suburbs. It's breakfast time in the Walter house. We make fruit salad for the kindy. Mm -hmm, yeah. With seven children living under one roof, the morning routine can be hectic. It's always a busy household. But for parents Paul and Chantel, the hard work is just beginning. Every morning this generous Seaford couple organises meals for hundreds of disadvantaged children in Adelaide South. Uh, one day my wife noticed this little boy walking in and said, oh, where's your bag, mate? And he said, I don't have a bag. And she said, oh, OK, well, where's your lunchbox? And he said, I don't get lunch. She came home, she was a mess, um, and it's kind of started from there. Breakfast Bellies was born. As the sun rises each day, Paul, a builder, collects food donated from local businesses. The couple then arrange and deliver the parcels to where they're needed most. How are you, Paul? Thank you so much. Seaford Secondary College, as well as two primary schools and two preschool programs, are among the recipients. They really make a difference. It makes a difference not just to the well-being and the health of our students, but also to their opportunity to concentrate and learn. Along with delivering food to schools, the Walters also pull together around 50 hampers a week to families in need. Thank you, Thank you very much again. Oh, pleasure. Appreciate it. Darren Etherington's wife recently passed and raising his two boys alone has been tough. So Breakfast Bellies has lent a helping hand. It's been hard but now it's eased the load, you know, having all this food and everything brought in. Breakfast Bellies feeds at least 300 people every week but demand from other schools in need has been so great Paul and Chantal want to extend the program. To do that, they need help. The couple has applied for a $50,000 Fund My Idea grant. It's now up to the community to decide if Breakfast Bellies or another worthy cause receives the money. Regardless, we will grow, um, but that would definitely give us a jump um, and help us help more people faster. It's rewarding. Well, it's worth doing. I'm very proud for my mum and dad. Very special people. Hannah Dawkins, Nine News.